Five free games in two minutes. Ten times the price of breathing air. Back to Bed, a really trippy and inventive escort mission game. A lot of great polish here from both a design standpoint and a visual standpoint. It's fair and fun to navigate the challenges, but it's worth it alone for the trippy nature and the hilarious voice acting. Air bluffs form lips. Moon Waltz. Really funny and hilarious concept here that I really can't give away. It's a one-button controlled game. This guy down here is walking constantly. What do you do and why is it so inventive? You'll have to find out. To my grandma. Another one that's really difficult to talk about without spoiling. It's a twine game that I suspect is very personal to the creator. I related to her feelings, her nostalgia, and what her grandmother meant to her for my own family. What Kim Delicious is writing here is something that really hit me on a personal level. I'm sure I'm probably going to get a few comments saying that this isn't a game and the game police are probably going to show up on my Twitter account. Go ahead and lock me up. This is a great game experience that I totally recommend. Tome a point-and-click adventure game taking place entirely in one room. It's one where you're not quite sure what's happening or who you are or what exactly you're supposed to do, but it's something that really pays off as you go along. I managed to get through the game without needing a walkthrough, and the ending is absolutely worth the hassle. Sound Dodger. I may have to apologize in advance for all the hours you may put into this thing. Concept's pretty simple, you're this guy in the center that has to dodge several projectiles being thrown at him being created by the song that's playing. With a wide range of musical artists, including a personal favorite of mine, Disaster Piece, there's a lot of great value in this interesting, innovative title. Want more free games to sink your teeth into? Glad you asked. Take a look at these. Thanks for watching, have a good day.